Hi, I'm Alexis Rivas, and this is your update for April 4th. This morning, many San Diegans will be attending Easter services in person, but there will still be some COVID restrictions in place, of course. So last year, remember, doors were closed to a lot of churches around Easter time because all services had to be virtual. Now we're in the red tier here in San Diego County, and that means places of worship can operate indoors at 25% capacity. Masks are required, but just being able to see someone in person is a welcome sight for church members who've been missing that sense of community. Easter Sunday means Easter goodies, and today there will be an Easter basket giveaway at Golden Hill Park. The drive through event will be hosted by the San Diego City Council President Pro Tem, Stephen Whitburn, along with the Imperial Court to San Diego. Mayor Todd Gloria will also be part of the event, handing out baskets to kids ages 1 through 12. The event begins at 1 p.m. And a reminder that in less than two weeks, indoor live concerts, performances, and sports could return to San Diego, California. Uh, to all of California, really, but here, of course, in San Diego, the state released new guidelines saying seated live events can resume April 15th with restrictions. With San Diego County in the red tier, only 10% capacity with a maximum limit of 100 people are allowed inside. But if you test for negative, if you test negative for COVID-19 or show proof of vaccination, that'll increase to 25% capacity. As the county moves to less restrictive tiers, those limits are also going to increase. And the state is also loosening restrictions for private events. Under the red tier, outdoor meetings, conferences, and receptions can resume with 50 people or less. Up to 200 people can attend, though, if guests test negative for COVID-19 or are fully vaccinated. For large indoor events, all guests are going to have to test negative or be fully vaccinated, and only up to 100 guests would be allowed inside. All of this very welcome news to the events industry, but no denying it has been a really tough year for those working in that business. County Supervisor Nathan Fletcher says he has a plan to provide more relief to the local events industry. On Tuesday, he's going to propose a policy to waive all permit fees for event planners, venues, and vendors. He'll announce more information on the plan tomorrow at 11 a.m. And today, the federal government is expected to bring in more children to the San Diego Convention Center shelter this weekend. Right now, the Department of Health and Human Services says 948 minors are sheltered at the convention center downtown. HHS also told NBC7 that 82 of them have tested positive for COVID-19, though none have symptoms. The shelter can continue taking in kids until it reaches a full capacity of 1,450 children. We'll continue to bring you the latest news here online at NBC7.com and, of course, on TV. You can also learn more on our podcast today in San Diego, where we give you the biggest headlines in less than five minutes. Stay safe and have a nice day.